I feel like PacSun is the perfect middle ground between the stores that get absolutely starched and bullied and cooked and the gang of stores over here that get more love than a dog at a house party, you know? These guys. I'd say, okay, PacSun is like Falcon from the Avengers. You know, he's like kind of an Avenger, I guess. He's officially an Avenger or whatever the stupid. But he's not that cool. He's kind of weak. His guns are really small, but sometimes... He got the schmooze, you know, he's, he's cool sometimes. What I'm trying to say is Paxson got some good stuff and they got some stupid stuff. And today you're going to learn how to properly style Paxson clothes. I'm trying this new series. If you guys like it, I'll do another store. Easy as that. If you don't like it, then I'm breaking the video down into three things and they're going to be tops, bottoms, and six shoes. Oh, you want to start with six shoes, huh? You know what? Yeah, all right. Let, let's start with six shoes. Starting off with tops, this one is where it gets you, man. This is where everyone ruins it. It's like when your waiter says, enjoy your meal, and then you're like, hey, thanks. You too. Enjoy your meal, waiter. Yeah, I didn't just do that at the Olive Garden five minutes ago, okay? Let me. That's what it's like when you get stupid tops from PacSun, you know? It's just bad. It just looks it's a bad look. There's a lot of novelty stuff like these tees right here. I mean, it's kind of funny, but like imagine how many kids named Daniel have this exact shirt. You don't want that weak stuff. You got to go simple. They got a lot of different basics to choose from, like hoodies, sweatshirts, long sleeves. The whole fam is here, dog. Like, no matter what your sexual preference is, we have it all. They have probably one of the best hoodie and sweat selections out of all the stores. Just basic stuff, like the PacSun store brand stuff, or the more expensive things, like the Fog Essentials line, if you're into that. The novelty graphic tees are cool for, like, a meme or something, but if your shirt consists of A, a rose, B, a skull, or three Japanese. Like I said, I really like the basic hoodies and the colors that they come in. PacSun's pretty good with their color palettes, I won't lie. But they should be. I mean, their name is PacSun. And the sun emits so much light. Like, so much. They can make hella colors with that. Just, yeah, PacSun hoodies and sweatshirts can get it. Basic is better. Simple is sexier. Allstate. Are you in good hands? Next up, we got pants. Paxson was infamous for ripping the fog zipper pants off. And then later, they adopted the fog essentials line. So I guess they're friends again. I don't fuck, I don't know. Other than that style, there's a lot of other cool stuff, but try to stay away from these things. They're bad news. They're, no. I heard they skip school and do meth. Don't, don't be friends with them. But their tracksuit pants, dope. Really vintage inspired. I like it a lot. Sweats come in nice colors too, like the hoodies. But outside of the athleisure and vintage streetwear selection, we got basics and essentials. For the quality, PacSun denim is, is not bad. It's pretty good. I personally like spending a lot of money on denim and then I can just wear them every day, really wear them in. But if you just want to try a new wash or something like that, PacSun denim is looking pretty like a snack pretty thick mood pizza pretty cool pretty cool i also just like the sweats for days that i'm not trying to do it to them too hard days where i'm just trying to chill i'm not trying to drip too hard but just don't do these tan these tan freaking joggers man that's enough of that okay these are like the streetwear equivalent of this tattoo like i'm not gonna tell you it's a bad tattoo it's too late you're already wearing it but i feel like you should already know that but while we're talking about bad the Christian Podcast. Episode 4 is now live on the Brew Podcast app, which is also available on Android now for all my less not as rich friends you can tune in on android too now also i thought i was gonna die like two hours before recording episode four so enjoy it please it's the deluxe episode i take some risks it's dangerous it's edgy but yeah the link to download and listen will be in the description lastly we got shoes and for the most part paxton has some of the best shoe selection out of all the stores i personally go to paxson all the time sometimes just to see what shoes they have a lot leaning towards the retro vintage sportswear which is a pretty good look i'd say in 2019 but just a great sneaker selection in general like i said earlier about the colors this bad boy slaps hood we got him in all sorts of colors you got a really good assortment of vintage sportswear and athleisure that's the main look i say that they really nail and for the prices i'd say it's better than like the flagship stuff you're gonna find at a nike store or an adidas store you know their name is pack sun the sun is 4.603 billion years old that's pretty vintage 
if you ask me. Packs on vintage streetwear. Okay, so thanks for watching the video, guys. And let me know if you like this store breakdown stuff. I can do more stores in the future. If you guys want to see that, comment the store that you want to see down below. Also, I'm like really sick, which is why it sounds like my sinuses are more congested than a Supreme line on a Thursday or Wednesday. When do they fuck? When do they really? But yeah, go follow me on Instagram at ChristianVY. I got this new theme going on. It's pretty fun to do. And tweet at me at ChristianVYYT. Join the Respect Women email club. It's down below and yeah guys i love you have a good day thank you for watching and um the sun is 4.603 billion years